I have a couple of announcements for us as we get close to the end of the school year. Um, we're going to test out a new arrangement for parking. So for all students who drive to school who don't have to leave at all during the day to attend like a CTE or dual enrollment or work-based learning placement, um, we're asking that you start parking near the glass doors by the high school gym. That way we can free up some parking in the back lot for students who need to be buzzed in and out throughout the day, as well as for our substitute teachers and then any um, visitors we have coming into the building. We appreciate your help with this and we hope that it alleviates some of the parking issues that we're having in the back of the building. Um, another thing, I wanna thank everyone for their um, hard work when it comes to our spring um, standardized testing. It's definitely not the easiest thing that we have to do, but I appreciate you um, showing up and trying your best on it. So thanks for that. And then um, lastly, I just wanna say that the end of the school year when it gets nice, it's so hard to maintain focus and stay strong. Um, please continue to do your best and uh, work hard connect with your teachers if you are um, missing school because there are a lot of sporting events that happen at the end of the school year and that requires a lot of time out of school. So make sure you're touching base with teachers about any of that and getting all of it squared away before the end of the year. Summer vacation will be here before you know it. Um, the month of April in the United States is Financial Literacy Month. And this year at Houghton, we decided to do a couple of events uh, relating to money and finance. The first event was we partnered with the Breakwater Federal Credit Union staff to host the very first reality fair in which juniors and seniors were tasked with putting together a budget um, at 12 different stations. They had to make decisions along the way. Uh, the second event that we participated in was the seniors in personal finance traveled down to the elementary school um, put together a lesson about money for an elementary classroom. This included different activities um, that they created all around needs versus wants, budgeting, how to save money, and just causing students in the elementary school to think about how money um, makes an impact.